And it's not a, a probability theory in the sense that we would usually think of probability theories. So usually we'd say, well, there's a 50% a chance it's gonna to rain tomorrow. Um, wh why do we say that? Why would we say such a thing? It's because we have incomplete knowledge of the system, in this case, the weather. And so we, we have incomplete uh, understanding of where, I suppose at the most basic level, all those water molecules are in the clouds and so on. But we, we, don't, we don't have enough knowledge to make to precisely calculate what is going to happen. And so we assign probabilities to it, which re that, that reflects our ignorance of the situation. The key difference in quantum theory is that these prob probabilities are fundamental. They are fundamental to the description of nature. So it is not the case that if, if we have an electron in some kind of configuration, then uh, our theory predicts probabilities because we don't quite know exactly what, how this thing is configured. The, the probabilities are intrinsic to the theory itself. And, and pretty much all of the, the intellectual challenges and the confusion around quantum mechanics comes from that very simple property.